Join Michael Voris in West Pleasant View, Colorado on January 19th for his talk on Light in the Darkness, the Splendor of the Catholic Faith and How to Live It. Click on the link for more information. Hello, I'm Michael Miller. And I'm Rebecca Hasenauer. Here are your latest headlines from churchmilitant.tv news. A member of a Connecticut parish caught her shirt on fire when leaning over to light a votive candle. She claimed the kneeling pad was too loose and slipped, causing her to sustain injuries. She sued her parish while the church used the First Amendment defense, saying the placement of the kneelers is within the interpretation of religious law. The courts disagreed and said plaintiff's claim can be resolved by the court applying only neutral principles of the law. Hinduism's sacred text, the Bhagavad Gita, will soon be appearing in hotel nightstands next to the Gideon Bible, courtesy of the Motel Gita Project. The project has already distributed about 150,000 copies of the text to 1,100 hotels and motels with an ultimate goal of placing a million books. Officials at the Army facility, Camp Pendleton, have declined to host the second annual Rock Beyond Belief concert supported by the group American Atheists. Camp Pendleton officials say they cannot provide logistical support, citing insufficient personnel. Recent media reports claiming China is going to phase out its one-child policy are apparently untrue. While a Chinese think tank had recommended the government abandon the protocol because of a, quote, coming demographic disaster, China's National Population and Family Planning Commission made an announcement celebrating the prevention of the birth of 400 million children. The Grand Traverse County Board of Commissioners has refused to forward a $12,000 grant to Planned Parenthood after calling them, quote, the organization designed to kill babies, end quote. The grant was from the Ottawa and Chippewa Indian tribes. The abortion giant says the funding will be used for abstinence-based sex education. Both tribes are now sending their request to the city for approval. I'm Michael Miller. And I'm Rebecca Hasenauer. Those are your headlines from churchmilitant.tv. Make sure you check out today's Vortex, where Michael talks about the deterioration of masculinity and our culture and the solution to it. Thanks for tuning in today. Spread the word about us to your friends. And may God bless you. Take your family on a Lenten retreat at sea with Michael Voris and Father Z of the world-renowned Catholic blog, What Does the Prayer Really Say? Couples and singles should also cast off to the Caribbean for this seven-day trip. And those who have signed up are encouraged to introduce themselves ahead of time on our Facebook event page. To sign up for the cruise, please visit the website on your screen or call 805-526-6565. That's 805-526-6565.